Hi, good morning YouTube, Sackboy Mahalo here with another video. So it's uh, fruiting season again here in uh, the Northern Hemisphere. As you can see, we have flower buds. And with the new uh, fruiting season coming in, we have new questions again. So we have a question, why are some uh, flower buds being aborted? So that's normal with uh, dragon fruit plants. Not all uh, flower buds will go through. The plant will uh, choose which one to abort. But there's a question, so uh, why abort the flower buds like this one here? It's been aborted. <laughs> okay, so there's two, two distinct stages of the flower buds being aborted. Or flower, it should I say. Or basically the fruit is not being uh, produced so the first stage is when the flower bud is forming and the second stage is after the flower has bloomed so we'll answer those two, two uh, distinct stages okay the first stage is when the flower bud is just forming before being uh, before blooming they they abort the main reason for that is the flower uh, the plant could not support that flower it takes energy to uh, produce the flower and more energy to produce the fruit so if your plant uh, doesn't have that uh, stored energy it will uh, a basically might abort the flower bud okay so how do you treat that one the first stage uh, making uh, main thing is making sure that your uh, plant is healthy and how do you do that uh, by adding uh, fertilizers or making sure that there are uh, enough nutrients or the correct nutrients in your soil so the if you add uh, fertilizer, then you add so, the, the required nutrients for the growth. Okay, that's one thing. Another thing is uh, making sure that you have enough sunlight. So uh, the dragon fruit is uh, needs the full sun. To, uh, to get the energy from so if uh, your uh, plant is being shaded then it gets less energy all right so that's another uh, way to make sure that your plant is uh, gonna have that uh, flower go through uh, its uh, full maturity Okay, the second stage is after the flower blooms. So this is uh, after the flower has bloomed. You can see some of them just die off and some uh, become fruit. The main reason for that is that um, when the flower, after the flower blooms and so many days your flower uh, drops off that means the flower wasn't pollinated okay that's the only main reason because it had enough energy to have the flower bloom so it's got enough energy as well to uh, make the fruit so the main reason not being pollinated so there's two kinds of dragon fruit the one that's uh, the fertile kind which uh, it doesn't need any cross-pollination and uh, of course the infertile kind which is 
which uh, is a variety that needs uh, cross pollination. So, um, so just make sure you know which variety you have. By the way, this one here uh, is the purple haze, and purple haze needs cross pollination. So this one uh, bloomed. If you're following the channel, bloomed it. This uh, flower bloomed like 10 days ago, and it looks like it's still viable and it's going to be become a fruit. So this probably is not a purple haze or it has been cross pollinated somewhere all right and this is the second one and it looks like as well it's gonna go into a fruit so that's it for today um, stay safe have a good one thank you for watching bye bye